How long and who will be the target of her attention this time? Jenny Bradley with the latest Street Talk tomorrow on GMTV. Welcome back. Larry, how did you do with Donna and Marlene then? Well, not too bad, actually. We've got a few problems. I wouldn't say petite ranges are perfect by any means, but they look an awful lot better. Do they? Yes. All right, who's our first model? Marlene? Yes. OK, Marlene, please come on. Marlene's wearing a rather glamorous evening look there. Um, now, that suit's really brilliant because everybody needs a basic black suit. And the jacket, is co it's got the fashionable long look, but it's not down to Marlene's knees. The jacket is actually Petite Principles, £70, um, as are the trousers, £40 from Petite Principles. And the, the little polo top, which is twelve ninety nine, is from Brianne Brooks at Debenhams. That looks really nice, Marlene. Do you feel rather comfy in that? You look very glam, because you wanted something for evening, didn't you? And is, is, was there any problems with that at all? Do you have to take it Tell in? Tell the truth, Marlene. Turn up. And I've got my sleeves turned up as well. Have you really? <laughs> just... how much? Um, a couple of inches, yes. A couple of inches? A couple of inches. <laughs> Which is ridiculous. Yes. I mean, that, that is the main problem with petite, is that although it might be small that way, actually, they, you still have to turn everything up. Yes, that's interesting, isn't it? Come and sit down, Molly, and you look absolutely lovely there. Thank you. I like these beads, too. Oh, they're it's wonderful, lovely. aren't they? They're glittery, aren't they? <laughs> you might be able to walk off in it. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Donna, Donna, this is our second model, of course, your daughter. Oh, that's nice. Now, Donna's wearing a version of the dandy. Um, again, we've got uh, the those little lipped in jackets. They may look quite nice on petite, but they're not terribly fashionable. So we've got the slightly longer jacket, but it is sized down for petite. That jacket is actually by Wallace, which is £65. The jodhpurs are £14.99. Again, Anne Brooks at Debenhams. And um, the shirt, which you can't quite see terribly well at the moment, is £21.99. Um, again, Anne Brooks at Debenhams. Can you show um, us the shirt, or is it too no, difficult? No, no, I think um, it in. Donna could put in there. There it is. Oh, actually, what, nice. what I will say is, is also, it's a bit similar to when you do outsize or what they call larger ladies. The <laughs> Why are you looking at me? I wasn't, I wasn't, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, fabrics aren't that great, you know what I mean? I would have liked to see more silk shirts, but there's a lot of synthetics around, because they seem to think mm. if you're short, you don't want to pay money for good clothes. Yes. Oh, and is that true? You'd no. be prepared to buy oh, yes. it? Of course you would, yes. yes. Now, Definitely. what problems have you had with that, Donna, honestly? Um, just the sleeves. How much are they rolled up? About, let's have a look, about two inches. Good heavens, yes. isn't that extraordinary? I don't know what models they have for petite. These guys are <laughs> gorilla people with long <laughs> arms. Very long arms, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Come and have a sit down, Donna. Now, this is the bit we're also looking forward to, because now it's Larry's turn to model her oh, little oh, outfit. <laughs> now, what are you wearing? Up you get. Oh, right. Um, and I'm... I want to see your catwalk turn that you were <laughs> yes. showing off Well, I do last need week. to run up, really, you know. <laughs> I mean, I need the 40-foot marble catwalk to do this properly, but I'll do my best, you know. I'll hit my mark. Right. <laughs> oh, what? Oh. <laughs> Hands in the pockets, you know. Now, what is that one? Or can I read it for you? Can I sit down now, please? No, you can't. You've got to stay there. This is actually... Now, this is from Principles, yes. as we can see. Petite Principles, the blouse is £55. Oh, another turn. Another turn. The trousers, very nice, are £40. Now, did you have a problem with any of that, Larry? Well, the trousers, you can see, are still too long. With Even high with heels with three-inch heels, I think they're too long. The sleeves, again, are a bit on the long side. The thing I, I mean, I'm not going to mistake this for Calvin Klein, you know what I mean? It's not that great. I'd buy the trousers, I wouldn't buy the, buy the shirt because I don't like those cuffs. Well, that's a personal thing, though, really, isn't it? Yeah, it's also, it's also a matter of the level of design, in my opinion. Could we have... Oh, my dear. Could we have one more turn, <laughs> Yes, please? I want to see how you really do the turn. This is how you do the turn. Go on, go on, go on, go on. <laughs> very nice, very good. Humiliated you enough. Come and sit you. down. That's very good. Now, the general problems with, with buying clothes that are not standard average size. Well, I mean, what, the one thing I want to say also is that Fern, although she's called me laughingly petite, I've never said I'm petite, I'm short. Most women are short, they're not petite. And so, You've like. You've got curves and things, Well, yes, you? I mean, I haven't got petite bosoms, Fern, I hate to tell you this. So, yeah. like most of the How jackets about you on women? me. Do you find that? I'm not too bad, don't I? Yes, you see, a normal size, you. Yeah. Yes. yes. <laughs> yeah. So, they, so basically, you just want things that have got short sleeves, the trousers are short, but actually got a bit of room to move in, and things tend to be a bit like dolls' clothes. Mm -hmm. Yes. What about shoes? Ah, well, I've, I've got a size five feet, so I'm OK. You oh, know, yes. I was obviously meant to be enormously tall, but my mother didn't <laughs> feed me properly as a child. <laughs> um, now, one of the only places that actually do do small shoes are 
Saxone. Do they? And they have a, a brochure, which isn't bad at all. Lots and lots of different styles. And I think we're going to have a, um, a phone number. There is number. a phone number, yes. I've got that here, actually. Are you ready with your pen and paper? There it is. 071. 6290231. Tall and small. Yes. So they do big king size sizes as yes. well as little ones. Yes. Have you seen that Saxon one? That's just where I go. Oh, no is shoes. it? Yes. And is, are you wearing the nub? Yes. Oh, uh, these are what just... you've got me, though. They're these not are my own. Saxon. Well, let's have a quick look. I wonder if you can see. These are Donna's, the nice little brown ones. Mm -hmm. the they look rather good. And next door, Marlene's black ones. How much do they? Can, can you remember off the top of your head? Um, putting I, on I the spot. can guess wildly, and mm. I can say probably about £30. That's not too bad, is it? No, that's no, all right. Okay. And they're comfortable. Yeah. And they're, and they're adult lovely. shoes for. Yeah. Yes. And those you haven't had to stuff, have you? No, these no. actually <laughs> fit. These, these are wonderful. <laughs> oh, Absolutely good. wonderful. But both Marlene and Don, you buy children's clothes as well. Don't you? This is yeah. another oh, secret. Yes. No VAT on there. Yeah. <laughs> that's what you told us. You do have to put up with the mutant ninja turtles on everything. You know. <laughs> now, actually, yes. Now Marlene was saying this. What she really wants is <laughs> leather gloves. And what do you end up with? Um, knitted ones with pom poms on or. Uh, an animal on the back, something like that. And just can't get gloves to fit. If anyone's got a pair of leather gloves, it'll fit these little. Look at these with my hand. Look, look, look. Well, Andrew, I have got very big hands. Now you're off to Milan, you little I jet am, setter. I am. Uh, and will you be back next week to tell us all the gossip? Well, I can't wait actually. Milan's a bit like. Um, well, I shan't say particular. One of the more, the more unpleasant industrial towns in Britain, shall we say? It's not terribly picturesque, so I can't wait to get back. You're just trying to make us think no, that it's not, not such a good life. What what collections are you seeing? Oh, Versace, Armani, Dolce Gabbana. Oh, know. dreary. Can you bring yes. us some samples back? No, I don't get any samples for myself. Oh, well, try, try. You're not trying hard enough. Larry, thank you very much indeed. Marlene and Donna, thank, thank you, you very much. You were thank great you. fun this morning. Great fun. <laughs> right after the break, someone who you could never describe as being petite, Mr. Motivator. See you in a minute. Listen to me.